Hey guys, this is Eclipse Gaming KSP, and I am sorry about that long break I took. I suppose I was somewhat of an idiot to not warn you guys. I was in Italy, but now I am back. Um, the thing I am starting now will be the biggest thing I have ever done if it's successful. I call it Eclipse Open Space. It's uh, basically a thing where you guys form an open source community and effectively run my space program. Um, so you guys write the script, except for like the main launch script if I've already done, and you guys plan missions for me to do. Um, I've already built the rockets, at least for now, so I'll tell you if I need any more of those. I don't yet. Uh, everything will be on Dropbox and the um, new Eclipse Open Source, um, or Eclipse Open Space, I'm sorry, uh, Google Plus community. So anyway, yeah, let's go ahead and get this Firebird 1 into the air. Delivers one ton to a 100 kilometer orbit. So yeah, let's see here. Lift now, yeah. So right now I am not touching the keyboard, it's just KOS doing the whole thing from now on. And this rocket doesn't accelerate too fast. It's a pretty slow rocket at first. But it has no trouble getting one ton into orbit. So anyway, yep. Let's um go ahead and switch to the next uh, there. Gravity turn beginning. You can see the fairing there at the top is procedural fairing. Other than that, uh, the rockets are stock. It's just procedural fairings and KOS are the only two mods used in these rockets. Uh, probe control room I have found really useful. It's a really great mod, you should check that out, but it's not essential for this rocket. Everything is still going well. We're starting to really accelerate now. We're at 150 meters per second, I think. Is that what it says? Um, yeah, 155. Sorry, my video editor makes it kind of hard to read. Um, so yeah, still kind of going up. Mm, stuff is still going well. Coming up on stage separation here. Um, stage separation should be occurring shortly. And we have burnout-ish, kind of. Thank you, burnout. And stage separation, you see the fairings there have done their job, they've separated. Um, second stage engine is not nearly as powerful and barely gets this thing into orbit, it barely has enough power. Um, so right now, time to apolapsis is actually decreasing. It will get down to about a uh, little above 30 seconds and then it will start to go up again. So, yeah. Lock is kind of shaking a little bit. I don't know why that, that happens, but it doesn't affect the performance. See in here, is that graph that's really useful. It shows um, the y axis is um, altitude, and the x axis is um, the time in the mission, which kind of shows you that we're not going up as fast as we were earlier. But I mean, that's kind of normal. <clears throat> Especially since we should be flattening out our orbit anyway because we will be circularizing not too far from now. So yeah. Not much else to say about that. I mean, I just need you guys to help write the code. Um, it's not because I want you to. I mean, well, I obviously do want you to, but it's because I am incapable of doing some of the stuff. I'm okay at KOS, but I'm not great at it, so I want you to uh, help me out with that. <coughs> Sorry. I, um, yeah engine should cut out shortly for our coast to orbit. Yeah. It's pretty fun. <coughs> I'm sorry, I seem to have like some sort of congestion or something. Whatever. But anyway, yeah, we've coasting now up to where our burn will begin. About 10 seconds before the apoapsis. And should be any second now. Three, two, one. Fire. Okay. So yeah, we're in orbit. Now we separate. In just a minute, we'll switch back to the uh, upper stage, which will deorbit itself, because I really dislike orbital debris. Build a space station once, and uh, it actually, like, 
blew up because of debris in space. So yeah, basically some of the things I need you to do are asparagus staging is the main thing right now. Um, I've tried a few asparagus staging scripts that I've written and a few of them work kind of, but not really. I want it to be universal so I don't have to completely rewrite it for each rocket. So you know, just change some variables for each rocket is basically all I want. So universal asparagus staging is what I want you, that's your homework. <laughs> but yeah, I've been Eclipse Gaming KSP, and until next time, explode responsibly.